conservative new media viewers, what's going on? It's me, John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion and the super genius. Hey, you know what? I've got an opinion on something, okay? And I need to tell you about this right now. First of all, my personal opinion, only knowledge, any facts, not casting any spurs, all for entertainment purpose only. Please check the disclaimers. Here's the thing I want to talk about. I want to talk about shopping carts. Oh, JDV, why are you talking about shopping carts? I'm talking about shopping carts because we in the world out there have to deal with them. And it's just something that it just was bugging me and bugging me and bugging me more and more and more. And this is what I mean by that. When I go to the, you know, the store or something like that in various places, and I don't know if it's a situation here in South Florida or if it happens all over the United States, maybe all over the world. I don't know, but, it, but I, I'm really noticing it when I go to the store, people seem to leave their shopping carts out. Now, listen, I understand. Maybe there's a big downpour or something like that, and you get caught out there. Or maybe, you know, you you're, you you have some kind of uh, physical situation, or you're, uh, uh, you know, uh, you have some reason why it's hard for you to put the shopping cart back, whatever like that. I get it. Sometimes these things happen, or there's an emergency, or whatever. And sometimes these things happen. But when you see, like, almost more shopping carts out there than cars, it sort of irritates me a little bit in that I, I just have to question the situation. And also, think about this, okay? Uh, the, it's not just leaving the shopping carts out there. It's like, no, you have different variances or different degrees, in my personal opinion, of this. Meaning, you have some people that will put the shopping carts up on the little, like, uh, tree islands like that. It's kind of like, so it won't move around. And, you know, at least, hey, at least you took a step to try to protect other people's cars and stuff like that so you don't have these runaway carts. The other thing I have to think about is, look, you know, in a lot of these places, there's always like little cart things staged all over the parking lot. It's not like it's that far. How hard is it for most people to like just put their cart back? Even, you don't have to go all the way back to the store. Just go to the nearest little cart section over there. But then you have some of these people that just kind of like, it's almost like they're doing something kind of sneaky where they're like kind of putting their, their cart where you can't see it or not so much like me in particular, but just kind of like they push it like near another car. Like, dude, why would you push a cart near another car? Like, does that make any sense? I mean, seriously. Now, of course, you don't want it just running around out there. But I mean, it's like if you're going to leave your cart out there, how about you take some sort of minimal precautionary steps. Listen, I'm not saying I have all the answers for this whole shopping cart situation, and I'm not saying that there aren't occasionally a good reason why some people leave their shopping carts out there in the parking lot. I'm just saying I think it could be uh, a much better situation than I've been seeing recently. I mean, come on, people. We all need to work together here to, to deal with this whole shopping cart situation, and that's what I'm talking about. I want to see the game taken to the next level out here. Be considerate of your fellow people and whatnot like that. I mean, I can remember I was just literally at the store not that long ago, and I, I go in there, I do my shopping, stuff like that. I come out, and there's like a shopping cart like almost this close to my car, and I'm like, dude, what's up with that? I always try to put my shopping carts back. Let's try to come together and, and, and make this shopping cart situation better. Yeah, and you think it's a funny situation, but listen, you don't want a shopping cart rolling down there and hitting your car and stuff like that, or you could hurt a person too. So let's, let's step up and do that. That's my opinion. I mean, there's plenty of places to put your shopping carts and most of these parking lots, or you can, or worst case scenario, you just take it right back to the store. Not that big a deal for most people, in my opinion. But I want to talk, that's my opinion. I want to talk about how you can share your opinion and you may be rewarded for sharing your opinions. Check this out. You can get paid to re and receive rewards just by sharing your opinions. I'm talking about OpinionOutpost.com, okay? You can earn cash, Amazon gift cards, iTunes gift cards, and so much more. The sign up is free. I'm gonna put a link right down there in the video description box. You can check that out. I would like you to check that out. And when you complete surveys, okay, Complete surveys, you are entered to win $10,000 in the quarterly prize draw. It's a great community and a great opportunity to get rewarded. Do the surveys, share your opinions, and get a piece of this reward situation. That's what I'm talking about right there. This video and shout out was sponsored by Opinion Outpost. Let me know what you think about this whole shopping cart situation. I want to hear from you. Give me the comments below. Please subscribe. I'm John D. Valero, the four time national champion and the super genius. You're watching Conservative Media. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.